How you doing, man? Hey, how are you? Alright, let's get this interview popping. Let's go. Daily routine, huh? Well, first thing, I don't sleep. I ain't got time for that. Next, I go in the kitchen, I eat my little breakfast, you know what I'm saying? I'm not going to tell you what I eat because that's confidential. But what do I do after that? Right, lunch, same thing, you can't know about that. Then I hit the courts, you know what I'm saying? I go out to the neighborhood parks and stuff, you know? Try to find some little, some younglings, so I can show them dominance. So who's boss? Then dinner comes around. Again, you know the drill. Then I go hoop some more to the big parks. Between breakfast and lunch. If y'all really want to know, I take my man bun every day. Five hundred strokes. Non stop. Now you know. So what do you do is there anything different you do on game days? Uh nah, not really anything different. Same routine, you know, breakfast, lunch, ball. But instead of five hundred strokes, I do a thousand, you know, I gotta look good for the honeys out there. Like I said, what I eat is classified. But you know what? I'm feeling generous today. I'm gonna show y'all a little something. where I keep all of my nutrition proteins, you know what I'm saying? See, I got the, got the sweet pea, you know, got to stay on my dairy cheese. Can't live without this. My peppers, you know, let go of my ego to go, you know what I'm saying? Got, I don't know what that is, but I got that. And, uh, Chicken. Let's check the fridge. Whoa, whoa, man. Whoa, back up. My fruits. My veggies. So you said you only eat healthy things, right? Is yes. That, yeah? Then what's the... What are you doing? What's that? What's that? Um. That, that, um, I don't even know what that's doing. That's, um, that's my wife's. Did you just? That's my wife's. You don't need it. She don't need it. But anyway, I don't eat anything bad, you know. Straight, straight healthiness in this, for this body. I don't go to McDonald's. I don't go eat pizza. I don't eat anything that's bad for me. We are here at Man Bun's house today. Shoot for this documentary again. Why is there a McDonald's bag on the ground? All right, maybe it's just his wife or his kids. I don't know. All right, let's see if you saw him right now. Hey, you ready? Yo, it's at 4 o'clock. It's 4 o'clock right now, bro. Oh my gosh. Look. He says he only eats healthy. Boy, wake up! What the f are you doing, man? Get the f out of here. You said you were gonna be here until 4. My man bus out of here. Ugh! Hello, and welcome back to the Rhino Sports Talk Network. I'm Donnie Trisdale. We have another recruiting update for you. Man Bun still hasn't revealed his, uh, his name, but he has revealed some of his secrets, specifically his daily diet. Although he said that everything he eats is under wraps, he revealed a little bit in his new documentary where he said he eats beans, fruits, and nothing bad, including fast food. 
I personally don't know how he can do it. I have to eat some McDonald's or Burger King every week just to maintain this perfect figure. This is all for your recruiting update. Now back to your regular scheduling programming here on the Rhino Sports Talk Network. What bandwagon should you jump on? What, what are practices like for you? Practices? Oh, I ain't really part of a team, you know what I'm saying? I'm my own team. I just go out there, find me a couple games, and I do what everyone else do. I just I shoot. I dribble a little bit. I shoot from half court sometimes. I just want to practice, you know what I'm saying? I've always wanted to be a globe trotter. I've been practicing my moves for years. I make sure my shots, they have to be wet from everywhere. From the three point, from the free throw, from mid range, you know what I'm saying? Woo! Woo! You know that, baby? I never miss! Dude, perfect. I'm calling you out. Call this one slap shot. I call this one the welcome wagon. Hello and welcome to Rhino Sports Talk Network. I'm Donnie Trisdale and we have a recruiting update for you. Most people would argue that college is the best place for high school basketball stars, but new top recruit whose name could not be found goes by the nickname Man Bun has decided to try something a little different. He's putting out a documentary to get drafted by the NBA teams and picking up games at his local YMCA. This is a bold strategy has no recruit gone directly from high school to the NBA without playing in an organized league. That is all for your recruiting update. Now back to the regionally scheduled programming on the Rhino Sports Talk Network. Who flopped better? It's always LeBron. So why are you playing basketball? Really? I've loved basketball ever since I could ever pick up a ball. It was just, just like fate. Like, but a real big reason is I, I, I be watching TV I be seeing how much these basketball players be making. It's a bunch of millionaires playing basketball. I'm trying to be like that. Now, I'm trying to send my daughter to school. You know, Harvard, Yale, Hastings College. You know what I'm saying? But, yeah. My daughter, she's she's a real inspiration while I play ball. Uh, she, I see her every day. And she shows me that I need to follow my dreams so she can live her life, a good life. I'm trying to send her to some good schools, you know, like I said before, so she can live good. And my baby girl, she's smart. She's the cutest little damn thing you'll ever see. I know this because I made her. And she's always having fun. And when she's able to pick up that ball, it's time. For my free throws, everyone has their own ritual. Mine is a pretty unique one. This documentary is about me. But here's an accurate defender for you usually. be a guard, but I also got moves in the post. No 
Nobody can guard me. Not even myself. I'm just trying to make a name for myself. I'm just trying to show the NBA how good I am. You know, just hoping I'll get drafted one day. What are the three? What three teams do you want to go to? Three teams. Well, first off, gotta go with the Bulls. You know, been my favorite team since a youngster, and try to be better than Mike. Oh, well, I already am, but I beat him one on one already. Second, obviously, I gotta go to Oklahoma City. I gotta t replace KD, cause you know how he did them dirty and left. Maybe go. No, I'm not doing Golden State. I ain't trying to blow no three-one lead. 